The four-door e-tron GT Coupe is a Gran Turismo with dynamic elegance, and an Audi such as the world has never seen before. The e-tron GT is powerful, sporty, confident, and emotive. It reflects all the passion with which Audi develops and builds cars. With its inverted color scheme, the singlifrom with the Audi rings on the expressively designed front of the e-tron GT is a clear indicator for the electric drive. The radiator grille, which reinterprets the classic honeycomb pattern, is painted in light hecla gray, or in body color for the first time at Audi, and the grille and lateral air inlets are framed by a mask in dark Manhattan gray. While well, the main purpose of the singlifrom on models with a combustion engine is to cool the engine, it conceals the majority of the sensors in the e-tron GT. Only the lower of the six corners have open sections for air supply. The technology packaging of the electric drive allows for a flat front end, thereby providing the driver with a fascinating view over the front end and directly onto the road. This view is focused due to the fact that the hood is framed by strongly curved fenders on both sides. This unusual perspective and the dynamism of the drive create a driving experience that shapes the character of the electric Gran Turismo to a great extent. The flow of the design is very obvious in the side view in particular. The elongated hood and flat windshield transition into a quickly sloping roof line. The greenhouse thus extends tautly over the powerful body. It is drawn in sharply toward the rear. The gently inclined C pillars in the rear area flow elegantly into the muscular shoulders of the body. Sharp edges extend across the large wheel arches. These quattro blisters with the pronounced sculptured wheel arches symbolize the electric all wheel drive. They are a stylistic feature of many Audi models, but nowhere else are they as strongly pronounced as here. The quattro drive is further emphasized by the combination of a low center of gravity in the main body section and the pronounced tapering at the car's midsection. The lean, elongated sportback cabin is positioned on the body with its flat roof line, which is another 0.7 inch lower than on an A7 sportback. It emphasizes the sporty body line of the e-tron GT. The headlights and rear lights are characteristic elements of the exterior design of the e-tron GT that further enhance the expressive exterior design. The LED light signatures at the front and rear feature pronounce three-dimensional modeling and emphasize the emotive look of the e-tron GT. The daytime running lights provide a striking light signature, together with the characteristic blue designer trim of the optional Audi laser light that is at the center of the headlights at Audi for the first time. The sculptural light strip at the rear spans across the entire vehicle width, changing dynamically from a line in the center into ever larger segments toward the outside, which makes the e-tron GT appear even more powerful. Three variants of headlights are available for the e-tron GT. Audi supplies them in LED technology with dynamic turn signals as standard. The Matrix LED headlights are available as an alternative. Their continuous high beams can shine with maximum brightness without causing glare to other road users. They come as standard with the RSE Tron GT. Topping the range are the Matrix LED headlights with Audi laser light. A laser spot is installed .ed next to the low beam module. The laser spot is activated from a speed of 43.5 miles per hour and doubles the range of the high beam. The lights at the rear are connected by a flat light strip. A visually offset diffuser gives the e-tron GT an unmistakable look within the Audi product portfolio. The spoiler with the integrated spoiler lip runs parallel to the light strip and rounds out the sporty look.
The top of the line headlights offer another characteristic feature, coming home and leaving home animations at the front and rear. The leaving home sequence is inspired by the power of a sound wave. The illumination of the individual elements builds up quickly and strongly, then retreats briefly, before going all in the second time. All the animations in the RS model are even more dynamic. The interior of the e-tron GT conveys the ultimate Gran Turismo feel by radiating sportiness, comfort, and expanse in equal measure. Sustainable materials also play an important part in the electric sports car. The strong focus of the interior on the driver, inspired by the monoposto idea, is a characteristic of sporty Audi models, and the e-tron GT in particular. The central dashboard is tilted slightly to the left, and the pronounced three-dimensional instrument panel looks light and lean. Its upper section is drawn away from the driver in a large, elegant arc. The display of the Audi Virtual Cockpit Plus stands freely in this space, while the MMI Touch Monitor is surrounded by a black piano finish bezel that seems to float above the instrument panel. If the Ambient Lighting Package Plus is on board, standard in the RS model, it features a lasered and backlit e-tron badge in the right-hand section. Aerodynamics isn't just the means to an end in the e-tron GT, but an important design feature. The design with its drag coefficient of 0.24 looks as if it were shaped by the wind, and it is. It was developed in close collaboration between designers and aerodynamics engineers. A strong contour separates the upper section of the instrument panel from the lower section, which contains the control panel of the standard 3's own automatic air conditioning system. The flat lateral air vents have a decidedly technical look and underline the width of the interior, with aluminum brackets surrounding their ends. A long arc below the windshield extends from one door to the other. The design of the sporty front door trims visually merges in a straight line into the fender edges of the front section. The driver and passenger sit in a sporty low position, separated by a wide center console. The compact selector switch for the gears is located on the center tunnel console. Its lean design emphasizes the airy sense of space and provides a highly precise haptic control experience. The rear seats offer sufficient space even for adults. The uncompromisingly high quality and processing of the materials reflects the attention to detail with which Audi develops and builds cars. The purely electric Gran Turismo from Audi offers dynamic performance in both engine versions. The e-tron GT Quattro accelerates from 0 to 62.1 miles per hour in 4.1 seconds, while the RS model takes 3.3 seconds, in boost mode in each case. The top speed is 152.2 miles per hour and 155.3 miles per hour governed, respectively. In the e-tron GT Quattro, the front electric motor outputs 230 horsepower, and the rear motor outputs 430 horsepower. Both electric motors keep reserves available for extreme driving situations, which is why the sum of their individual outputs exceeds the drive's total output of 473 horsepower considerably. Up to 525 horsepower are available for APROX. 2.5 seconds in boost mode via launch control. The total torque is 464.7 pounds-feet, in boost mode 472 pounds-feet.
In the RS e-tron GT, the electric motor at the front axle also outputs 230 horsepower, while the motor in the rear outputs 450 horsepower. The total output is 595 horsepower, and the total torque is 612.2 pounds-feet. In boost mode, the output briefly increases to 643 horsepower. The permanently excited synchronous motors in the e-tron GT work with great efficiency. The electric motor, its power electronics, and the transmission form a compact block on both axles. The rear electric motor transfers its torques to a two-speed transmission. The close ratio first gear ensures spirited acceleration right from the start, if the driver so desires. If they choose not to use first gear, the e-tron GT moves off in second gear. Generally speaking, the long ratio second gear improves efficiency and also provides large amounts of reserve power. The suspension is one of the elements that play a crucial role in shaping the harmonious overall character of the Audi e-tron GT Quattro and the RS e-tron GT. It is a congenial partner to the dynamic drive, while always remaining confident and relaxed no matter how much strain is put on it. This too, perfectly embodies the Gran Turismo philosophy. The wheel suspensions are designed as a sporty double wishbone construction. Almost all parts, including the links and subframes, are forged or cast from aluminum. The electromechanical steering has a sporty and direct ratio without appearing abrupt. Audi supplies all wheel steering as an option. While the adaptive suspension is optional in the Audi e-tron GT Quattro, it is on board as standard in the RS model. Its three-chamber air suspension enables comfortable basic suspension and can adjust the body to different heights, 0.9 inch downward and 0.8 inch upward. The chambers in each spring can be activated and deactivated individually to suit the driving situation, and they work closely together with the standard control dampers. Both systems are managed by a central control unit, the electronic chassis platform. In the Audi Drive Select Dynamic Handling System, the driver can specify how the air suspension, dampers, electric motors, two-speed transmission, and controlled rear axle differential lock are to operate. They can switch between the comfort, efficiency, dynamic, and individual modes via a switch. In efficiency mode, the body is lowered to the low level to promote better airflow, and the top speed is limited to 87 miles per hour. In dynamic mode, the electric all-wheel drive, the suspension systems, and active aerodynamics are set to a sporty mode. All Audi e-tron GT models in the US will benefit from a 93.4 kWh lithium-ion battery pack, with a unique integrated cooling structure underneath the battery pack. This draws heat away from the battery pack, and allows the battery to be housed within an aluminum frame designed for structural rigidity, and to protect occupants. With an 800-volt electrical architecture, the e-tron GT comes standard with the ability to charge at an industry benchmark 270 kilowatts using DC fast chargers. This allows it to replenish its battery from 580% in just 22.5 minutes, among the quickest charging rates currently available of any EV preliminary manufacturer's estimated ranges based on approximation of EPA test cycles for a full charge are 238 miles for the e-tron GT and 232 miles for the RS e-tron GT. EPA estimates not yet available at this time. 
the 2022 Audi e-tron GT and RS e-tron GT will arrive in the US this summer and will be offered in three grades, the GT Quattro Premium Plus from $99,900, the GT Quattro Prestige from $107,100, and the RS GT from $139,900, with all prices excluding destination and taxes. However, Audi says that the GT models may qualify for up to $7,500 in federal incentives. Production will take place at Audi Ballinger Hof at Neckarsalm in Germany. In its home market, pricing will start at €99,800 for the Quattro and from €138,200 for the RS.